Whether you are an experienced medical practitioner or you are a student just beginning their studies, the Model Med Charlie and Charlie's Mum Obstetric Examination Simulator will enable you to develop and enhance your core competencies required to manage childbirth. The Charlie and Charlie's Mum Obstetric Examination Simulator will allow you to assess the position and station of the fetal head. The simulator has ischial spines so that the practitioner can assess station. All model med simulators have ischial spines except for the gynaecological trainer. Before running a simulation, please watch our video on preparation and maintenance. Place Charlie's mum at the front of the desk. You are going to need two people to complete the simulation, one mother and one midwife. You can then choose one of the three types of cervix. These represent the cervix on a baby's head when the birth is imminent. There is a multiparous cervix, a primiparous cervix and an edematous cervix. You are able to accurately simulate scenarios using these cervixes. Take Charlie's head dry. Do not lubricate it. Place the cervix you wish to simulate over the head. Choose a level of dilation. The friction between the rubber and the head will hold the cervix in place. The midwife is not shown this step. Lubricate the cervix and inside the birth canal. Now push the head and cervix into the birth canal. Please lubricate the vagina and fingers prior to inserting them into the vagina. The midwife is then going to put their fingers into the vagina and they're going to feel and try to work out from the simulator, one, the dilation, and two, the position of the fetal head using the sutures. One of the real advantages of the model med cervix is that it can be stretched to any size dilation. You can also simulate an asynclitic cervix which is not symmetrically open. To remove the Charlie head, lubricate your hand and slide it inside the top of the birth canal at the rear of the model. Gently cup it over the front of the head and cervix and pull them firmly backward and out. Once you have finished your simulation, ensure you follow the correct procedures for cleaning and storage. Again, proper maintenance will ensure the longevity of the products. If you have any further questions, visit the Model Med website.